So I have a question. Do you yeah. guys do this like every Saturday morning? Go yep. out and see what kind of bark? Oh, That's yeah. awesome. The weather's right. Good morning, guys. Morning. Yes, it does. Oh, wow. Um, go ahead and grab it. Can you get it? Have you guys been over to uh, the other Mason one? Um, the other one, I'm trying to think of the street, it was like all toys. Mallard Cove. Yeah, it's just all toys. Oh yeah? And when you plug them in, it wouldn't unless you have the adapter for the newer phones, it's like the plug-in kind. So right. You'd have to have a uh, this is the game? Okay. I'm gonna take the sticker off. I'll take your sticker off of that. Seven dollars. So I have a question. Do you yeah. guys do this like every Saturday morning go yep. out and see what kind of bark? Oh That's yeah. awesome. That window? That's yeah. hers. I'm like, I don't know what I use it for, but <laughs> I got my hand on it as soon as I saw it. <laughs> All right, we're going to do the window. Would you do seven on these? Sure. Okay, so I'll get 12. And I'm going to take this sticker off those because we're trying to keep track yeah, of the sure. things, if you don't mind. There's that. Hey, Dad, can you get the sticker off of that window? Thank you. Thank you. And how yeah, much was the window? Five. Five. Okay. 12 bucks. Thank you. There you go. Thank you. All right. Have a good one. You too. I'm gonna buy your lamp. Okay. I'll just set it right here if that's all right. You see, there's a Google Home Mini. Mm -hmm. That's pretty cool. Oh, yeah. I don't know if you'd want that or not. Those are Blu-rays, but these are games for a dollar piece. Okay. I've done checked all those. Hey, it's in there. Okay. Yeah, where'd you get it? I, I bought it from the company, uh, I think it's Plantronics. Or oh, really? Yeah, I bought it directly from them. So. Do you make t-shirts? Uh, I did for a brief moment in time. Yeah? Yeah, I, I bought it brand new, I think it was like $360. Jeez. It was like a couple hours total. Yeah. That was the end of that. <laughs> okay, yeah, I'll buy it. I owe you 10 for this thing and uh, 2 for the lamp. Okay, I think we're good, but thank you, though. Here you go. Thank you. You guys have a good day. You, you mind getting that lamp, Dad? Sure. Right there. Actually, I might get this. Okay, cool. I just want to get rid of it. All right, thanks. That's right, cool. The doctor's in. It's mm -hmm. funny. Have a good day, guys. Yeah, you Morning. How you doing? Good. How you guys doing? 
with that. Okay. Are you nine dollars for these? Let me see what I can know. This one's never been opened. So I, yep, that would be. Do you need a bag or anything? No, that's okay. okay. You have a single by chance? I do. All right. Enjoy it. Thank you. Thank have a nice you. day. Daddy got a free hand. You think that? Can we pay you, sir? This is four. Those are our fifty. That's five fifty. This is fifty, so it's six. There you go. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Good luck with the sale. I can get the rest of this done. You got those? Hey guys, it is now Monday morning. I went garage shielding on Saturday with my dad. We had a lot of fun, found a lot of really good stuff. I'm going to show you what we got. All right, we'll start over here. Picked up a Herbert Hoover bobblehead. This is a Washington Nationals giveaway. I paid three for that. And then I also got a uh, Petco Park like stadium replica for $2. My dad found a couple things that I didn't notice. Um, I saw this and I just kind of walked by it. I didn't really pay attention because I was just like, oh, it's just a DVD player. But it is actually a DVD recorder and dad spotted it. Um, they wanted $20 for it. I got it for 10 and it sells for about 40 bucks. I got this Playmobil set. Um, this I got this at the one sale where like everything was a good price. I wasn't really trying to talk down. Like we're just I was just grabbing up a bunch of stuff because it was cheap. Um, I didn't even look to see if it's complete, but any kind of big Playmobil set like this, when it's three dollars, I'm just gonna buy it. I got this um, vintage NBA lamp for two dollars. Pretty cool look. That shade is awesome. I mean, you can. See how old it is, because there's a Seattle Supersonics. They're not a team anymore. The Vancouver Grizzlies are now in Memphis. Washington Bullets. <laughs> yeah, this thing is probably late 80s, if I had to guess. Got a giant Snoopy Pez for a dollar. I got this uh, Disney Animators Collection Mulan doll for five bucks, new in the box. Got some Beats headphones. I rarely ever buy these, because they're either too expensive, uh, they're knockoffs, you know, there's a lot of reasons why. 
I've really never bought Beats headphones. Um, these were $10. She said they were first generation. And from what I can see, I think they're legit. I don't think they're fake or anything like that. She was asking $10. I got them for $7. And it looks like they might be worth about $40. bucks. they are really clean, too. Most of the time when I see these, the ear pads, you know, are just shot. Just in really bad shape and just not worth messing with. But these were in good shape, so I went ahead and bought them. Got a couple of these, like, new in the packaging science kits. Uh, let's see, I got two of these 10-can robots. These were $2 each. And then I got a tabletop robot for $3. I got this for free at a sale. I bought something and... I picked this up and it said free and she's like, just take that. We don't want it. I was like, okay, cool. So it is a uh, Charlie Brown um, musical snow globe. Don't know what it's worth, but for free, kind of hard to go wrong. I got two of these Cincinnati Cyclones wands. I guess these were like some kind of like Harry Potter giveaway thing. Those were 75 cents each. This was a good find. Lego DC Superhero Girls. Um, this is new in the packaging. I could tell because the Lego actual tape right there had not been removed it was perfectly sealed uh, i paid four dollars this is worth about 40 or 50 bucks at that same sale i got this board game in the plastic uh eternas that was five bucks and i think i saw comps selling for around 25 30 dollars something like that okay a couple more things over here i got this uh what is this barbie or is this just a regular doll yeah this is just snow white and the seven dwarves five bucks I think it's from like the mid 90s. Let's see here. 1998. Didn't look up comps, but I bet it's worth at least 20 bucks. It's even got an old KB toy sticker on there. Check that out. Got this Harry Potter game for $4. Uh, actually, it's a 40 puzzle. I'm sorry. Wizarding World of Harry Potter 40 puzzle. Anytime I see Harry Potter stuff, if it's cheap, I just pick it up because it sells so well. All right, last thing I bought. This is also something dad found, and this was the best find of the day. This is a laser alignment system for a heat press um, if you're making shirts. So I looked it up and the guy said he spent $300 on it when it was new. And I think he was right because from what I could tell, that's about what they sell for new. I saw a used one had sold for around $200. The box is in a little rough shape, but he said he only used it once. I guess he had planned on making shirts and it just didn't work out. And this thing's really clean, so for $10, I had to take a chance. Even if it doesn't work, I can, you know, sell it for parts or something. So that was an awesome find by Dad. That's it for this video, guys. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.